Sean, what are your thoughts on the Saw X trailer and the premise of the film? So, a couple weeks back, or a week back, they dropped the first trailer for Saw X. And the premise of the movie is that it takes place between Saw 1 and 2. Jigsaw, John Kramer himself, is actually the lead character, the character that we're following in the film. And essentially, he's like trying to get an experimental cancer treatment done to try and save his life and ends up doing a series of games on some people that we're doing some fraudulent work. I just finished literally this morning my rewatch of all the Saw movies. I'm getting way ahead of myself apparently. I've rewatched all the old Saw films, finished Spiral literally this morning. There's, the franchise has always treated John Kramer, Jigsaw, the star of the franchise, really weird he is the main character of the franchise but thus far in nine films he's never been the lead character the closest to him being a lead character was in two and three where in one of them he's in captivity police captivity and still only a side character and in the third one kind of a co-lead in the film but he's he's literally on his deathbed he can't do anything what we've never seen in this 20-year-old franchise with nine films is the lead of the franchise doing his thing. We've seen flashbacks of him doing his thing. We've had him... They played around with timelines to show us him doing some stuff. We've never had a movie that focuses in on him just doing his thing. And in just in terms of the franchise, they made the very weird choice to kill off the lead of their franchise only a third of the way through. <laughs> like, there's nine movies. The star of the franchise dies at the end of the third movie. Spoiler alert for an 18-year-old movie, but it's 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 like very clear in all the other movies. That's the whole premise is that he's dying. So it's not really a spoiler if you haven't seen it. He's never the lead. It was such a weird choice. And so, honestly... I actually, as someone that, I didn't watch any of the Saw movies when they first came out or until till, uh, Jigsaw. That was the first one I saw in the theater, and I, the, I watched all the previous films for the very first time leading up to the release of Jigsaw. So, in a lot of sense, I'm pretty new to the franchise. I dig the concept. I, I like it. I feel like that actually is the missing piece of the franchise. That's the thing that we need to kind of complete it is a movie where you see Jigsaw actually in the lead doing his thing. I mean, it goes from the first movie where he's barely in it. He's talked about, but he's not really a strong presence in the film to the end of his life, custody, deathbed. There's a piece missing right there. And that's the movie they're making. I dig it. I dig it. As someone with very little connection to this franchise went that like, I don't think any of the Saw movies are great. I go... Yeah, I'm sure that that feels like the right movie to to throw right in there. Most of these clips are pulled from my weekly Patreon live stream. Join at any level and you can join the chat and ask all the questions you want. That's for as little as $2 per month. For $5 per month, you can get your name on my end card. For $25 per month, you can have a monthly video chat with me. Link is in the description for more details and keep talking movies and TV too much.